Hello and welcome back to our channel, where we cover three new travel destinations every week. Today we will be covering the top 10 attractions in New Zealand, a country known for its excellent hiking paths, vibrant Maori culture, gorgeous national parks, and top-notch skiing and surfing. The Fiordland National Park in Milford Sound Besides having some of the best strolling paths in the world, Fiordland National Park is surrounded by breathtaking scenery. You can enjoy unrestrained waterfalls, distant islands, unspoiled rainforests, enormous lakes, and rugged mountain summits. The park is included in Te Wahi Ponamu, a place recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Milford Sound, located at the northernmost and most approachable portion of Fiordland National Park, offers one of the most refreshing maritime sceneries in the world with its majestic summits and deep blue waters. The fjords are frequently explored by sea kayak and tourists can also take a sightseeing flight above the park to get a bird's eye view of its breathtaking splendor. The spring months of New Zealand are September, October, and November, which are excellent seasons of the year to visit Milford Sound. Tongariro National Park Tongariro National Park is situated in the middle of the North Island at a short distance from Lake Taupo, the largest lake in New Zealand. A striking landscape is created by towering volcanoes, untamed woods, dry plateaus, geishas, stunning lakes, and luscious grasslands. Thus, Tongariro is one of the best locations to visit in New Zealand and one of the world's oldest national parks. It is a site of beautiful views and natural grandeur. The Tongariro Alpine Crossing is also a must-see in the national park. In 1887, Tongariro was designated New Zealand's first national park. A little more than a century later, the park received recognition from UNESCO as a world heritage for its natural wonder and for being a culturally significant site for the Mori people. Ancient volcanoes, scorching craters, and unique alpine gardens are just a few of the volcanic wonders on display in the 80,000 hectare park. Rotorua Rotorua is considered as one of the world's most intense geothermal areas and is located on the turbulent Pacific Ring of Fire. In addition to its geothermal activity, it has some of the world's most beautiful scenery. Rotorua's striking landscape is further enhanced by boiling geysers, scorching mud pools, streaming springs, and volcanic craters near Lake Rotorua's southwest corner. It is a must-see destination in New Zealand for anyone with a sense of adventure. Thanks to options like skydiving, trekking, and mountain biking. Additionally, Rotorua is regarded as the primary resort and conference hub of the district. Maori still make up a sizable minority of the region's population. Still, the area has long been one of the main centers of Maori culture and customs in the state. Bay of Islands Next comes the stunning Bay of Islands, located three hours to the north of Auckland. It is one of New Zealand's most well-liked vacation spots and has a 500-mile or 800-kilometer long shoreline. The sparkling harbor is dotted with more than 144 islands, making it a dream place for boating and windsurfing. It includes historical attractions like the Waitangi Treaty House and activities like deep-sea fishing, hunting, and scenic splendor. The tourism hub of Urapuka Puka is also a part of the region. You can simply explore untouched woodlands or paddle along the coast, hike the island trails and unwind in secret bays. It is also a well-liked fishing location because of the quantity of marine life there. It is rich in biodiversity and has species like penguins, huge marlins, dolphins and whales. Together these factors make the area a desirable travel destination in New Zealand. Franz Josef and Fox Glacier Fox Glacier and Franz Josef Glaciers, located in the center of glacier country, are two of the world's easiest glaciers to reach. These glaciers are the stunning Westland Thai Potini National Park's main draws for visitors. The ice rivers flow from some of the Southern Alps' highest peaks to a point close to the sea, where the pleasant coastal environment makes it simple for tourists to tour them on foot. The trip might be ideal for you if you enjoy hiking. You can choose to walk there or take a helicopter, but make sure you do not neglect these incredible natural treasures. Given the variety of activities available, this place is fantastic for everyone who enjoys sports and adventure. Apart from adventurous activities, you can also choose to unwind by taking a soak in the warm glacial springs. Napier Napier, a city in Hawke's Bay, is well known for its fine dining and art deco buildings. 
It is also renowned because of its unique and elegant construction. An earthquake in Napier in 1931 completely destroyed the city, but later it was restored in the same Art Deco and Spanish mission designs that the Miami Beach is well known for. Today, visitors can enjoy themselves by visiting Napier Beach or enjoying a self-guided tour of these structures, some decorated with Maori designs. Every February, thousands of tourists go to Napier for the Art Deco weekend, a celebration of the style that includes vintage automobiles, picnics and soapbox debris. Mount Cook National Park Located on the South Island of New Zealand, Mount Cook National Park is about two hours from Lake Te Kapo. The park covers an area of 722 kilometers square. The tallest peaks in New Zealand tower over the alpine vistas of Auraki National Park. The permanently snow-covered mountain rises to 12,316 feet or 3,754 meters and is surrounded by 22 peaks higher than 10,000 feet. It is also home to the Tasman Glacier, the country's longest glacier, and the tallest mountain, Auraki Mount Cook. This area is a popular mountaineering destination. There is a ton of fun activities for ordinary tourists such as beautiful treks, helicopter excursions, and dining with stunning views. Every traveler should spend at least a couple of days there. Kaikoura Kaikoura is a wonderful day trip destination just a two-hour drive north of Christchurch. The lovely coastal village of Kaikoura will appeal to nature lovers, wildlife enthusiasts, and seafood lovers. The atmosphere in Kaikoura is genuinely breathtaking. It is nestled between the seaward Kaikoura Range and the Pacific Ocean and offers top-notch coastal treks and well-liked whale-watching excursions. Passengers may see fur seals, dolphins, and a wide variety of birds, including the elephant albatross, in addition to sperm whales and humpback whales. Thus, seafood enthusiasts will find paradise in this South Island beachfront village. Land lovers can go for a hike through the stunning and wild Kaikoura forest. Additionally, there are numerous cafes, eateries, and stores to discover. Abel Tasman National Park the enormous Abel Tasman National Park can be found on the country's South Island's northernmost point and is every hiker's paradise. It is only accessible by boat, foot, or small plane, but the journey is worthwhile. Blue penguins, oyster catchers, wood pigeons, and other uncommon species can all be spotted while traveling over the rugged landscape. One of New Zealand's great walks is this park's Abel Tasman Coast Track. This beautiful 51-kilometer journey runs along sparkling Tasman Bay from Marahau to Separation Point and lies in one of the warmest parts of the South Island. You can take full advantage of being in this remarkable place regardless of whether you have a lot of time or just a few hours. Unbelievably, you can refuel in the middle of the park after a day of sightseeing with hot coffee, refreshing beer, or a mouth-watering meal at the magnificent lodges scattered around the coastline tucked away among sweeping sheltered coves and subtropical native woods. Muriwai Beach Located about 40 minutes outside Auckland, Muriwai Beach is considered one of the New Zealand's finest beaches. The shoreline is truly breathtaking and the region also hosts a vast gannet colony. The place is attractive because of the fantastic surf, huge sand dunes, and magnificent sunsets. It's no surprise that Muriwai is regarded as one of the most popular vacation spots. If you go at the right time of year, you're sure to see the dozens of gannets on the cliffs, which make this a must-see for any wildlife enthusiast. Muriwai Beach is also a popular surfing location, especially good for those who want to avoid large crowds in the waves. If you enjoyed this video, you should definitely watch this next trending destination. Don't forget to like and subscribe and let me know in the comments below what was your favorite place. See you next time!